Welcome, everyone. It is I, Mike V. Hope you are having a wonderful day today. In this video, we're going to be tackling an interesting question. Can you give yourself a better chance of hitting a royal flush? So let's go ahead and move on to the next slide here where we're going to discuss briefly royal flush hit frequency. And then we're going to take a look at all of the vari uh, the common video poker variants in question. So so if you want to get a royal flush and you get it on the deal, congratulations, that is a very difficult achievement there. So if you were to be in dealt a royal flush right away in the initial five cards, it's a 1 in 649,740 chance of that happening, or it'll happen 1 in every 649,000 hands. However, to get the royal flush by the, by the draw, so after you do your discards, it depends on the strategy you use for the video poker variant in question. So the odds of getting the Royal are dependent on whether you're playing jacks or better or double double bonus or some other game and the strategy you're using. So that actually influences your long-term chances of getting a Royal flush or what the expected uh expected number of royals you should get uh, over a certain period of time. So the next slide, uh, I'm going to be showing you some figures that, is, uh, that show you which, or rather what the, uh, the odds of getting the royal flush on each common video poker variant, so jacks are better, bonus poker, etc. And this assumes optimal video poker strategy. So we'll go to the next slide here. Royal flush odds. So 9-6 jacks are better. It's 1 in 40,391. And this is the reason why you hear in other in other uh, publications or whenever you do some research on video poker, you'll hear people commonly say, oh, the odds of getting a royal in video poker is 1 in 40,000. So, you know, that's, yeah, that's typically the case, as you can see here. But you have to, so we're going here a little bit deeper than that. <laughs> why is that the case? Why is it a, a 1 in 40,000? Well, as I mentioned before, it's uh, based on off of the strategy. But if you play a different strategy, the odds change because uh, it's based off of the probability from your strategy. So if you take a look at other pay tables here and other variants, and the pay table does have an influence as well because it influences the stra the optimal strategy, uh, you'll notice that the amounts uh, change slightly depending on the variant. So 8-5 bonus poker, it's... Uh, 1 in 40,233 hands. 9-6 bonus poker deluxe, it, it's uh, a little bit tougher to get the royal. It's 1 in 42,077 hands. 10-7 double bonus. This is the one where where uh, I found out is the hardest, or at least the odds of getting the, getting the royal are harder. It's 1 in 48,048 hands on average. And this is assuming you're playing optimal 10-7 double bonus strategy. 9-6 double double bonus, it's 1 in 40,799. Uh, the not-so-ugly Deuce's Wild Pay Table, the 16-10-443, it's 1 in 43,456. So even with Deuce's to, to figure out, uh, even with Deuce's to deal with, uh, natural royal flush, you cannot have a deuce, but you're going to be holding deuces quite a bit when you get them in the deal. It's still about four, 1 in 43,000. Now, Joker Poker is where things get interesting because that's that's an extra card in the deck. So the full pay Joker Poker pay table that you find at the plaza in Vegas, if you uh, to get a natural royal flush there, the odds are 1 in 41,214. Not much different. Uh, but if you take a look at a different pay table for for Joker Poker, the 940-17-7 pay table. So this is where a Royal Flush jumps up to 4,700 credits. The four of a kind pays 85, and the full house still pays 35. So in this version, you're actually more likely to get the Royal Flush over time. It's one in 38,478 hands. And that's despite the fact that there are 53 cards in, in a Joker Poker game as opposed to the 52-card deck. And the Joker cannot help you for a natural royal. If you get a Joker with the royal, you get a you get paid a Joker royal flush, which is not included in the statistics for for the uh, that that's on screen here. 
And then on the bottom here, I've decided to look up the probability of what happens if you implement a strategy of going for the royal flush at all costs. So royal flush or bust. So you do nothing but hold cards that help you get uh, get the royal and ignore everything else. Don't do this <laughs> in real life, but for the curious, it's a 1 in 23,081 chance of getting the royal when you do this. So it's still not going to happen in most circumstances, even though, yeah, you improve your odds, but would you really discard a four of a kind of go after a royal flush? I mean, I looked at the payback percentage uh, assuming the Royal Flush still paid 4000 It's horrendous. <laughs> you don't want to do that. Royal Flush or bust, don't try it. Does It's not worth it. Now, before we end off the video, so these are the, uh, all the most common variants. There's still a couple we have to discuss, so we go to the next slide. Triple-double bonus and triple-triple bonus. In addition to paying, uh, getting paid 4000 credits on a Royal Flush, you also get paid 4000 credits in other... For other hands, four aces with a kicker, and in the case of triple triple bonus, it's four deuces, threes, and fours with an ace kicker. So I want to factor these in as well because because they pay the same as a royal flush. So I I think if you get four aces with a kicker and triple double bonus or a royal flush, you'd be happy with either one because it pays the same. So so I did some math here. So we looked at uh, so the odds of getting the Royal Flush in Triple Double Bonus is 1 in 45,000. For getting four aces with a deuce three four kicker, it's 1 in 14,000. If you combine the two the, and, and you look up the odds or the probability to hit either of those two, it's 1 in 10,823. So your probability of hitting, a, hitting the top award is much better in these games where you're... Uh, you have different uh, uh, different hands that will hit it. But let's take a look at 9-6 triple-triple bonus. This will be the last one. A royal flush is a little bit better to hit, 1 in 41,034. Four aces with a deuce 3 and 4, it's about the same as in triple-double. It's 1 in 14,136. Uh, and then we also have four deuces, threes, and fours with an ace kicker is one in 12,906. Combine these three together, and you're looking at the odd, the probability of hitting any of them, it's one in only 5,794 hands. So if you're looking for the best chance of hitting a 4,000 credit payoff, Triple triple bonus might be the game for you. However, I do want to stress this out. It is incredibly volatile. If you've watched my previous video on on uh, taking a look at the pay tables of all of the bonus poker games, you know, from bonus poker to triple triple bonus and everything in between, you'll you'll notice that the variance of this game is ridiculously high. So volatility wise, you you will lose your 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 uh, session bankroll most likely before you before you hit it. So this is a type of game where I would where where I would say hit and run, you know. So play a play a, play a quick session and then if you win decent, you know, just leave. The probability though of getting the of get of getting the four thousand credits is is your best shot here though. So it is your call on how you want to how you want to uh, play it. Just know that you'll probably have more losing sessions before you hit it, even though you're more likely to get it. There's just there's just a not gonna, there's not going to be a uh, a lot of uh, play or session play throughout the uh, throughout your 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 attempts. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and end off the video here. Let me know if you have any questions about this particular topic or any questions you may have on video poker. If you enjoyed it and you haven't done so yet, do me a favor and hit the like button. If you're brand new to the channel, be sure to subscribe, share the video with others, and hit the bell icon to be notified once I release a brand new video. Until then, I will see you for the next one. Have a great rest of your day. Take care and go make it happen.